The minute I go out, chances are she's gonna cry, especially when I open the door because she's gonna, she's gonna see my shadow and she's gonna act all dramatic. And usually the minute I walk towards her, she'll think that it's me opening her crate, but I don't want her to think that every time I just come close, it's because I'm responding to her crying. I wait maybe a few minutes before I go out because if it's immediately after she whines or something, if my timing is off, then she'll think that when she whines, that's when she gets the behavior. So I'm trying to train her otherwise. I go out and then if she acts up, then I go back in. <laughs> it's really, it, it takes time. But that's how I did it for the girls. So let's see if she's gonna cry. I'm gonna move close and I'll walk away. Off! Excuse me, why are you on my pillow? Thank you. Told you so. Now we're gonna close the door. I'm asleep already. Not all rainbows and butterflies. That's why I try looking for a good breeder that knows how to train. You will be dealing with this. She calmed down a lot faster now. Let's see if I open this if she's gonna start to happy. Okay. That's how you desensitize them. When they give a behavior I don't want, then they don't get attention. It's just repetitive things of this one. It just takes time, it takes a lot of effort, and regardless of whether you're working or not, it's really doable. It's really just you making time for it. There's really no excuse for it. Like, if you want a dog, then take the responsibility. You, you know for a fact that it's gonna take a lot of work and it's up to you <laughs> but you know you, if you don't want the discipline and it, you you don't want to do all the hard work in the beginning for a lifelong convenience of having dogs like summer and baby then that's your choice i mean don't blame it on your dog or don't blame it on your trainer that it's not working for you or it's taking longer you gotta start in as soon as possible, as, as young as possible. There, she calmed down. Let's see. It's me doing this repetitively until I get the behavior that I want. That's how training is. <laughs> it's pretty boring, honestly. But for me to be able to illustrate like the realities of it, then you know, you have to deal with the boring videos because training really is boring. Cause I don't like forcefully well, I kind of in a way, but not in a negative way or anything. 
not like hurting the dog or anything like that but trying to get the behavior that i want with consequences because it is what it is i want a disciplined dog i want them to be able to assimilate to my lifestyle it's either that or uh risks of having a dog that needs to be rehomed let's try she's trying to observe my shadow <laughs> i look ridiculous doing this See, she calms down faster. 